Hello, everyone. We have a little special production from one of our members, Skittles. He's got a road to our very own KOC2 Wrestle Kingdom. One of our first days in this tour to get there in the future while we're doing our Fire Festival, some request shows, and much, much more. Who do we have with us today? Announce yourself. Announce yourselves. It is I, the guy. Fuck, you know what? I'm too busy playing Texas, but um, <clears throat> it's me. Skittles, Mal, Zero. Fuck. Next question. I am Pure Power, your host. And then. Your host, Tony Guy Schmas. It is I, Zach George 98. The server's re resident deathmatch and Napoleonic history nerd. How's everybody doing? And, and a I'll no mic the, chat. I'll we... do this one as well. We've got Jug in no mic chat. All right. And let's see what crazy show you got for us to start off. All right. Uh oh. Yes. My name for the day is Jugs, Big Jugs. So I have, if y'all want to, you know, sub, sub to my random channel, y'all can. It's just me posting stupid shit, but. So the match card for the day is a is an eight man tag between the IWO fuck em, and Blue Wolf, who is trying to stop the IWO with a failure. So so he decided to to like pick up Curry Man, Marv Fuji, and Toba. And then the next match we have the next match we have the um Tiger Mask Slayer Kinamoto versus Tiger Mask. And then we have um the fucking failure known as Otami taking on against Ogawa. Last time and I checked Otani's got yeah. a higher score in the Fire Festival than Jun Kasai. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Anyways <laughs> Then then we have a tag match between Takatana, which is Takayama and Kitanahashi taking on against the Funk Brother. Six man tag action, the three musketeers, I let you guess who, taking against the four pillars of heaven, I let you guess which three. Then then the semi main event is fucking Inoki, taking against Kenta for the revenge at the G1. And then the main event is main event Kasai, taking against Onita, in a barbed wire death match, also known as Zach's, Zach's favorite porn category. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you we got a crazy show, you, man. You shut up, you son of a bitch. Well, let's start <laughs> off our show. Oh, my. This is... Look Tano how Musaku fucking... Toba. Oh, dear. This is going to be a very one-sided bout. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking IWO wins this one because it's... Yeah. IWO. Well... We may find out who will win or who will lose. So, funny story. Blue Wolf picked this guy because he looked like an Enochius. <laughs> well, let's see if that works out. We'll see. For a second, I thought that was going to be a three count right there. If, 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 if it would have been a three count, I would have just, you know, fucking just quit booking. At so, so since this is a road to show, this is basically where storylines, you know, grow in or continue. So, I guess for our sake of Wrestle Kingdom, what do you think might be like some views going into Wrestle Kingdom? Well, I definitely know IWO. I didn't ask the bitch. I'm not, I was asking Zach, so I know. I'm sorry. Uh, I... Pretty much the big feud is going to be IWO versus Puro as a whole. Alright. What about you, of course? Because the IWO are some evil spineless bastards. You think? Alright, how about you, of course? Well, I'm thinking you know, based of course, off I of... asked course, sign up. <laughs> so, so, so me, you, you were asking me yes. again. So as I was going to say before you interrupted me, talk to me. I was going to say that with the IWO, you might see some junior junior action where they try to show off once more. Heck, Pretty I wouldn't much. be surprised if Dory Funk Jr. does something. 
right. I know. Alright, since I can't look at the fucking, um, the chat. I'll do Jug. that for you. Alright. Jug, what do you think some major storylines gonna happen going into Wrestle Kingdom? Well, so far, he just said that uh, Zack stole Pyro's line. Damn. That's He's typing something right now. I don't know. I'm eating. I'm going to make a guess. That He's a probably eating a sandwich. A sandwich, also according to Heavy off the of Team Fletcher's 2. Sandwich. <laughs> oh, wait. I was right. Cool. What? It, it was a sandwich. <laughs> What are you fucking? Hey, how'd you how'd you guess correctly? Bitch, you guessing? Ooh, he uh, was he right. said BRB, so we got a bit before he does anything. Uh, eleven. Yeah, eleven is Zach's favorite number, next to twelve. According to my sources, the one counting the um during uh the countouts was actually Zach. That was his voice. Oh shit. Oh, Zach, what was it like being Zach. a referee in this match? No, he's an announcer, dickhead. You know them announcers. Any fuck me. <laughs> How about no? Yeah. I, don't, I don't go that way, and even if I did go that way, I don't think you'd be my type. Bro, same over here. I don't know how to react to this right now. You don't. Uh, Yamazaki doing some damage to Toba here. Oh, right. Why did why did the kickboxer just throw a random Enzo Gary? Because he's crazy. Because he's from DDT. Yes, he's from DDT. So, what sense is supposed to make? He's from DDT. Yeah, they're just circling around. But hey, we got Marufuji in the ring now. You know. So I was thinking of some fucking uh, matches, my predictions going towards Wrestle Kingdom, and I think one match that might eventually steal the show will probably be either the main event or the semi-main event, or, or the um, Pinocchio try to buy out every single fucking Puro like he's Mr. McMahon. Yeah, why would he want to do that? Because he's maniacal. He has diabolical. Because he's an evil bastard that needs to get hit in the back of the head with a brick about 27 and a half times. How do you hit someone in the brick with a brick in the back of the head half a time? By only using half a brick. That, that still counts as a brick, as it's going to be lethal no matter what. What? Are you all no, it, it only counts as a full time when you use a full brick. It's half a time when you use half a brick. Matt. I've never heard of this before. And the Fire Pro Special, the greatest yes. move in all of Fire Pro history. The it's, greatest it's, of all time it's, in the fucking history of Fire Pro. It's, it's called, it's called Inoki Matt. Mask. Get, it's called Inoki Mask. Get used to it. I don't think that's Inoki Mask. Wait, you Inokius? What the fuck? No, I, no, I, I, I just, I just had to say that. <laughs> Otherwise, uh, Inoki would do various things that I don't want to talk about. Yes. Ah! Like, oh, no. Get back to full screen. I did not give permission to go to take it out. We're in the middle of a recording. That's very inappropriate and unprofessional behavior. It blew what Wolf is out being, being insulted. I'm the most unprofessional guy here. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> no, either way. <laughs> Ton. Zach, how much they paid you doing? Uh, I'm, 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 I'm not at liberty to discuss that. Otherwise, people would come after me. Did you sign a non? Did you sign a figure, NDA? Did you to sign be a an NDA? <laughs> did you just sign an NDA? To be a dang, freaking ref dang, of all dang, things. They paid you all. Uh. Uh. Maybe. Well, either yeah. way, Curry Man doing some work on Bob Sapier. He did a but, freaking but, rock up bottom. But, but nah, actually, actually, they, 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 they only, 
it only paid me a uh, it only yeah, paid me a hundred a hundred grand Japanese money, so you can do the math yourself on what that converts to an American. Hmm. Sounds like a nice amount. Yeah, for now. For now. Look at all those knees. Toba doing some good work with Yamazaki. So who do you think is going to take the pin? Or eat the pin? Well, if the IWO is to lose, I think the guy who's going to lose for them is going to be Goto. Tatsutoshi Goto. Meanwhile, for the Blue Wolf team, it could be Toba. Or even Curry Man. Or Blue could... Wolf. Bro. He the one who tried to start the resistance that nobody asked for, but... Everybody needed. Could... Yes. But nobody asked him to start it. Damn. Ho Toba seems to be putting up a decent fight, you know, being a real fighter and all that. One, two... Oh, by the way, I, I was, I was, I was not, I was not refereeing. I was just doing in-house announcing. Yeah, uh, why? You're right, course. Oh boy. Oh, not for the, not for the <laughs> entire card. Just, just, just for, just for, for a few matches. They, they said they, they said they need. They said they absolutely needed my voice, but they couldn't afford to pay me for the entire card. Yeah, are you that expensive, or are they that cheap? They're both. <laughs> just I, both. I think they're just that poor. Damn. I did not know our own promotion was that poor. <laughs> no. For no, our that, organization. The venue? No, oh, no, yes, we are here at the Yuki Duki Patuti. Dojo. That, that was that wasn't even us. That that was uh, that was that was a certain e evil bastard that hired me to do hired me to do in-house announcing for a couple matches. I don't know how he wants to buy buy out the rest of the Piro scene when when he when he's too broke to hire me for a full card. I think he does that to taunt you. Like, I but, could afford um, you if I felt like it. But, Zach, are you going to do the, um, the deathmatch one? Are you going to uh, do the voiceover for the deathmatch, or... What? That... 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 That's the... That's the one... That's the one I really... I really wanted to do, but he wouldn't let me do it, the bastard. Oh shit! Oh, Toba beat Fujita. Nobody Imagine. saw this happening. With a let's go to the instant out. replay. With a to see, drop to see how that happened. It's the replay. Oh, oh it was an the Gary. Kicked him Enzigiri. in the face. <laughs> he just jumped up there and kicked his face off. Yep. That was. Out of nowhere, I I kind of was looking away for a second, and it just happened. Uh, the IWO Toba. loses. Toba knocks out Toba. Fujita. That's one. That's one. That's one win for Team Piro Res. Right. But I got. But what's crazy is that Toba was the one that fucking did it. In all seriousness, I, I wasn't really expecting Toba to be that much of a savage. But okay. Yeah, now we have Koji Kanemoto and Tiger Mask. And the feud of this is basically <laughs> Koji wants to be the Tiger Mask killer because he was Tiger Mask, you know, three, right? Yep. So he was like, I'm tired of y'all kind of making another Tiger Mask. I want to be myself. So he decided to go after this every single last Tiger Mask. Now, this was his first shot. <laughs> now, I. Now, I. Now, seeing as how I I have experience with the Tiger Mask persona, I was I was specifically requested to do in-house voiceover for this match. How were you a Tiger Mask predecessor? What are you, Tiger Mask negative one? 
I think he's talking about how he's such a big fan they gave him the spot. Uh, I'm a prick. Yeah. <laughs> what else is new? <laughs> due to my... Due to my f familiarity with the character, and let's just leave it at that. Oh. Damn, you're he's furry. <laughs> no, fuck, fuck off. My man dirty bitch. Well, of course, a furry. I mean, being a furry is not suck. being dirty. I mean, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind fucking a furry. Okay, that's something the furry would say. You, you and I individuals. I, I was curious. Yeah, they all say that. That I look the furry. Like wrestler. the old famous quote, "I'm not a furry, but." Nah, I was. I wasn't even denying it, but like um. But I was curious. There is a furry e fed, and I did sub to it, and they are on Fire Pro, and I and, and I gotta be honest with you, it's actually not bad. That is very, very. No, weird. like literally, that it's something really like not that bad. exists. I'm I not... don't know how to. No, as a, like as a they... worker, I don't know how to feel about that, bro. No, like, it's really not bad. It's actually pretty good. I... Even though it's not for y'all, but I'm just going to give them a little shout out. Keep doing what you're doing. Fuck these guys behind me. They are just haters. Nah, I, got, I got no problem with the community. I'm just not a member of said community. I know. I mean... If, if that's what y'all want to do, yeah, if that's what y'all want to do with y'all fate, y'all do y'all shit. Best of luck to you. I am flabbergasted. Flummox. Flabbergasted. Let us stray. Speckled dwarfed. Confuggle. Buggle. Uh, bamboozle. I've never been bamboozled so hard in my life. What did Jug say? Because I feel like Jug just says... He hasn't come in back yet. Oh. He hasn't come yet? Uh, I mean, it's really hard to make a Frenchman go when you talk about furries. Now, if he was German, it'd be another story. I mean, who doesn't like a good German, you know? I can think of a few people that don't like Germans. What, Jews? Well, well, Polish, Austrians, Dutch, Danes... French, English, Belgians, especially Belgians, Swiss. Like, we going? Oh, it Blaine. is JM. Welcome, JM. We're in match two. <clears throat> uh, hey guys. Yeah, we yes, just going. missed a weird opening match for this Road Two show. What is this? The Road Two our Wrestle Kingdom? Yep. Yeah. We had four members of the IWO: Fujita, Sap, Goto, and. Did I say Saps? Yeah. Yamazaki. Against that DDT kickboxer Toba, Blue Wolf, Naomichimaru Fuji, and Curry Man. Who do you think won? IWO, right? Uh, no, Fujita got knocked out by Toba. By oh, Enziguri. Wow. <laughs> oh, well. He kicked you know, uh, Yeah, back right now I'm just getting. Yeah. Hard, he went to sleep. Yeah, so right now I'm in the neighborhood. I'm getting something to eat real quick uh, before I get back to the apartment. All right. Okay. Yo, um, I got the weirdest request. What was All this right. request? Another request. Somebody wants me to do a league, a round robin league, with okay, with six, with with zero one people plus with six, with a few zero one people and Curry Man. Why? Why is everyone going wild for Curry Man all of a sudden? So they want Curry Man, they want Vansack Acid, they want Wagyuda, Shinsuke Yamagasa. Let's go to this the has to be... hold on. Okay, hold on. I'm going to go to the YouTube comment, and I'm going to tell you exactly who they wanted in it. I swear, that has to be a Rasta comment or something. Let's see how he won, shall we? Let's he see. won. But, let's see. Drop to the hold. He rolls him up. Won by a 
fucking roll Counter up. roll up. Very classic way. Well. Okay, I got it. So, All ends well. they want Hoshikawa, Hayashi, Kaz Hayashi, um, now Hiro Hoshikawa, Vansak Acid, Yamagasa, Wagnuta, and Curry Man. It's not that bad, awesome. but it's still kind of just out of nowhere. Yeah, what are those because, names? You, you, you gotta, gotta love know? Curry Man, bro. No, but, yeah, but that's pretty random. But, um, and then I found the craziest comment ever in, in fighting it, in a, in a fighting video. Oh, dear. But I'm going to tell you, I got, but I need to be in front of my laptop to tell it, because it's going to be hard for me to tell it on my phone. Oh, because, right. like, you're going to have a hard time reading it without dying of laughter? Yes. Okay. I was dying of laughter when I was on my 15. Um, so somebody did the old, uh, war has changed. In fighting each other, they used the, uh, the, you know, the Metal Gear Solid 4 video of War Has Changed. Oh, boy. And they did the complete Solid Snake opening with SGP terms. <laughs> <laughs> to summarize the fight. And then, in that comment, right, If you, I, when you go a little bit deeper in the comment, they did their own version of the Metal Gear Solid 2 moment where Raiden's talking to the AIs. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> With fighting game shirt, with fighting game stuff, and it's fucking hilarious. And I have to live read that. Oh, definitely have All to right. live read that. I and have to. I have to live read it. All right. While we're waiting for if that, only, unless unless you know somebody knows how to do the uh, what does anybody here know can do a good solid speak impression? War has changed. I can. I know yeah, I well, we, well, well, like, like, I like, we have to live read this comment because I literally was dying of laughter going through the entire thing, and it's a long one, but it's so fucking funny. I could do steak for you. I could do steak. Yeah, for you, you, you could do the war. You could, like, of course, you could do the war has changed one, right? Yeah. <laughs> and I'll read that long, that long one. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> I'll read the long one because I'm used to reading shit like that. All right. All right. While we are getting that all set for the future, we have Shinjiro Otani right, versus Thanks. Yoshinari oh. Ogawa. We have bird box and we also have burrito box. Oh, if yeah, have burritos. Burrito. All right, man. Thanks. I'm right there. Enjoy. All right. Oh, Judd's okay. back. Yeah, because um. Went to get some, yeah, so my food's ready. Now, I guess this place does burgers, but they also do, like, burritos and tacos as well. Oh, my. I guess it's a new <laughs> thing they added. I thought that one Russian girl I usually see there would be there, be there, but she wasn't. Oh. Uh, it's probably... You know, J.M. Love... Off. J.M. Love his Russians, you know? Yeah. Wait till you see his selection of vodka. I mean, my ex was a Russian. I mean, hey... Russian, Russian. Gotta love him. Oh, is he gonna yeah, do the run off the ropes? No, nope, no, nope, he just wanted to no. bash you know, I'm, I'm, I Man, kinda feel bad. I'm just glad this day is... Uh, dude, I'm glad that this fuckery of this week is finally over. You know what I mean? I'm glad yeah. this fucking week is finally over and my schedule is, no, is back to normal. All right. That's definitely like, you know, and the good thing is, is that uh, you know I wasn't feeling all that great on the fourth of July, so I couldn't come in. Luckily, I, I, I my sick time did go through, so I got that pay even for the for that holiday pay. Okay, that's definitely a good thing. So, yeah. So, and then you know, and I got mad. I, I was always getting mad tight this morning because. They were like, yo, I got to talk to somebody because too many of y'all are off on Tuesday. I'm like, yo, man, you better. Nah, I ain't coming in. <laughs> that don't work for me, brother. Well, I'm going to say, fuck no. You damn right. Well, not in that way. Because that would have gotten me into some shit. <sighs> oh, man. I, I can't wait to finally see my. I can't wait to, you know, to finally see my mother in, uh, in September. I haven't seen her since 2018. Oh, wow. Yeah, that is a long time. Yeah, so I haven't seen her since October of 2018 when I moved to this, when I removed to New York. Shout out to all the mothers out there. Yeah, so, so you don't tell your my mother's mom gonna be... that you love her like once a week. 
Think you need to get yourself a date with a freaking rock. Yeah, think about it. Yeah, yeah, no, because my mother's gonna be in New York from like September, I think, four for the, I think September third to the tenth. I I requested the fourth off, so I got the fourth off now. Oh, good. So that way, you know, I could spend the whole day, and if there's any other days I have off that week before the tenth, I could probably maybe go see her one more time. Hmm. Oh, oh yeah, and also, bombs. yeah, oh yeah, Zach. Yep. Okay, so I checked and I got July twenty second off, so I'm gonna try to get those Arthur Ashe tickets on that nice. day. And uh, about World War Three, I know I started it earlier. Oh, did you finish it? No, nah, but. Back to the match. Somebody survived the critical. Oh, Otani survived the critical because of rope break, and then he got a 2.9 on a pinfall. So he's been. Oh, what critical type man. was it? It was a submission critical. Yeah. Well, yeah. his stamina is probably fucked now. Yeah, oh, it is. <laughs> this is definitely the best match on the card so far. Right. Uh, rope break. This yeah. is why, like, I don't know, like I don't know if I told y'all this, but. When I was telling y'all about this, like, Road 2, I did say something like, this is just like in a Coliseum with how the matches were like. And hey, survive crits, bruh. He just <laughs> ran stayed into the corner and he just plopped on the ground. Was Tony able, uh, able to get some of his stamina back? Oh, yeah, he managed to run the ropes with the drop kick. Oh, that's got to be it. Unless he kicks out. No, nope, it's just enough. Yeah. Well done. Well, yeah, he ha his spirit is probably super low, uh, empty at this point. But still, even if, you survive, even if you survive a critical, you know your spirit is fucked. Shall we do like the instant replay? Uh, it would have took in like it would have took in like one submission to end the match. Now we got Takatana in matching gear versus Terry <laughs> Funk and Dory Funk Jr. I had so, to pick like a good matching gear for them, so I picked that one. So <laughs> what what we've got is the Pacific Theater in a wrestling match, Japan versus America. Oh, uh, well. Terry Funk, I'm gonna go and slam the big Takayama Maniacs out here. Oh, Takayama Maniacs. Jug just said. I just found a comment by Jug said. I heard your comment about furries. <laughs> so JM. What? What what do you have to say about furries? Oh shit, look at this RDC by uh Harry. That's right, I know how to spin around it. Oh crap. You spin me wow wow me wow. Me Terry Funk, I'm gonna go and make him run around and spin around. I've once went to meet spin, I know I'll well win this match. <laughs> I'm gonna kick his ass. Oh crap. I wanna kick his sorry S A W L A. Hey uh guys, okay, so give me a little bit, I'm gonna change and I'll meet up with you in the in the chat. Alright, All see you right. here for me soon. Alright. You know he's getting ready when you hear the echo. That that's right. how you know someone's prepared. I I've played Kingdom Hearts once, I think. Uh, JM just ignored the question about the furries. He <laughs> no sold that shit. It's like, yeah, I don't have time for this. I, I'm I'm entering my apartment. I don't want to talk about them when I'm entering. People might hear me. <laughs> my man was over here like, I ain't I ain't dealing with y'all bullshit about fucking furries, but I ain't trying to talk to y'all about furries. God damn it. Speaking of furries, you know what I like to do? I like to beat every single one of them down to the ground and put them in a spin toe hole. And then brand them. That's right, I brand them like a bull. If y'all brand them, y'all basically treat them like animals, you know, like, right. cause. They wanna act like animals, I'll treat them like animals. I'll even kill them and eat their meat. What type of meat, though? I'm gonna make burgers. It's kind of sus there, Terry. How dare you question my authority? I'm Terry Funk. 
Oh, by the way, y'all, y'all know how the, y'all know how Funk's branding actually worked, didn't you? I did not know that. It was, it was, it was basically. I had the gimmick explained to me. It was basically a tattoo with a bunch of fake smoke. Oh. This seems legit. So far, this tag match has been treated like a tag match. Here's my brother door. He's in it. Look at that. Have y'all have y'all have y'all seen that video of old old ass story just yelling the phrase "Don't quit" while cracking a cheap looking bullwhip? Bro, that shit was too funny. I'm I'm trying to find that video again because I was dying laughing. I That's saw, actually bro. on one of my alt accounts on YouTube. It's called Motivational Speaking. Wmv. Because <laughs> I thought that was the best term for. Something like that. The greatest motivational speaking. Don't quit, crack whip. That was that because like he's the PWF chairman. He's technically the boss figure on All Japan Pro Wrestling currently. So something like that made me laugh. Like now, do you think WWE would be better if Vince McMahon went around saying never quit and crack a whip? Worse. Yeah. Of course. I found your other account. Yeah. I'm about to... But, like, correct me if I'm wrong. This ain't... <laughs> Is this your other account? Looking on my chat. Nope, that's not me. <laughs> you spelt my name wrong, that's why. I just found a point, though. I feel like I am drowning, drowning meme AMV. What the fuck is this? Uh -huh. Freaking furries, I swear. They find anything and try to make a fetish out of their fetish. Like a sub fetish within the fetish. I don't get it. Never quit. Never quit. <laughs> That shit is too funny, bro. <laughs> of course, Jug thinks I'm a furry now, apparently, despite the fact that's not my name. It is, now. <laughs> no, it's not. You yes, misspelt it, it. That's someone different. I... It's like thinking Jake and Josh are going to be the same person. They are. It's <laughs> oh, no. Yes, they oh, are now. Submission hold. Okay, he broke out of that. Who do you think is going to win? The I... Funk Brothers or, or Takatana? It, yeah, I think Takatana has a good chance because Takayama has strength, while Tanahashi's I'm, got speed. Has I'm, speed. I'm going to take the Funks because the... Because the funks are just violent, they beat you, they drop you on your head, and they do not give a fuck. Never quit. Never quit. The funks are, the funks are pretty much, oh, somebody bleeding and fire! Did I think Inoki while I had my head shaved? Uh, no. No, I didn't. I apologize for nothing. Oh, Tanahashi's bleeding. That's right, Tana's gonna have to learn how to really fight, mother bitch! Oh, like that? Is that good oh, enough for you, Zach? Oh, by the way, if if y'all haven't, haven't figured out my character's style of wrestling, it's just be aggressive as possible and beat the fuck out of you. Uh, so you're basically... Every monster wrestler, when they debut in the WWE, before they turn into a comedy character. Uh, Mal, that's pretty accurate about... Yeah. The version of fire from me, isn't it? Just beat the fuck out of people? Yeah, and, and you wonder why you keep on fucking up on the, like, a certain wrestler's... I booked you against. What I'm trying to see, like, it's gonna be a good match. You, 
You you nearly had it. Like you always nearly you about to win. But you taking your opponents for granted, even oh, though they're not as violent. Oh, rope break. You got a critical on the roll-up. Terry Funk is in bad shape right now because he just got a critical done. Yep. But now the match is even. Oh, uh, yeah. It's Dory's in it now. Taking your, taking your opponents for granted, especially if they're not as violent as you. But yet, you you. But you can't. That's Dang. such oh, a story. Rough break. Dragon screw. Then, then I think I need like updates or a repackage or some shit. What about my character? How would I act in the ring? You will act like Kanamaru. Yeah. <laughs> Something like that, or no, like sir. heel version, just modern day Kanemaru. Face version, Basically. Curry Man, maybe. That's how I see you. <laughs> I'm not gonna hold you. You're like more like Kanemaru. I can see like how freaking you come in with the whiskey, and then you <laughs> heal master. Then I go on the mic and I say, your local sports team sucks, and everyone boos. No wonder y'all can never make it to the World Cup, because all of you suck. <laughs> Soccer players can't win a freaking game of football. Stuff like that. Oh, we got two submissions at once. This is... Oh. Man, we're getting some good matches here on this row, too. Yep. This one and the Otani Ogawa. We told him Wrestle Kingdom is coming up. Look at him now. <laughs> oh, he's got it now. Is this it? Oh, wow. Just... What's he got? What a kick. Enzo the Gary. very kick that... Uh, Another one! Yeah, the kick that Toba used on Fujita earlier in the show. Five he minutes left? Went. Oh, there's Another a 30-minute time limit. Someone needs to win this. Oh, Doomsday Device. The, a, a top rope double hex handle. <laughs> that Greatest. is... That I don't is. know how to react to that. That was... That's a thing. That was interesting. <laughs> Choice of a, of a double team move, am I right? <laughs> yep. He's got a dragon sleeper, that could be it. Nope, nope, not enough. No, is Dory gonna actually. Oh no, he's got a spinning toe hold, that could be it. Nope. What a knee. It's another spinning toe hold. And it's over. Just enough. What a match. Yeah, Dory was definitely the MVP of this match, I would say. Yep. I'm going to say this, though. We Is need... It... Huh? Is it me? Or, 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 do the, or do the bleeding textures... Actually, look a little bit better in uh, in returns. Oh, definitely. But uh, yeah, Jug, I saw your your <laughs> your comment about the tags for a tag tournament in KOC two. I want to finish some of the other stuff before getting to that. Before I think about it, but it's on the backlog. But let's and see that color puro commentator. Okay, champ emoji. Play by play, pure commentating, weird champ emoji. Yeah, you guys need to make me play by play. Someone try to do some more. <laughs> Nobody <Damn>. can. <laughs> I'm not good at this, apparently. <laughs> but yeah, we and... have the three musketeers and the three of the four pillars. 
And um, is that and Zach, I would, I, I do agree with you, and I think the reason why it's like that is because is it's because the game is old and grimy. It make it look so good. Like, look how old the game is, and look how grimy it, it kind of looks. That's why it's some of the. That's why I really like returns textures than um. Worlds at hot times because like, of the grit. Like, yeah. Like in in order for the blood and world to look really good, you need the blood mod. Yeah. Yeah, but I got one comment here. Jug is not happy that Tao Wei is in the match, but not Kobashi. My guess because is Kobashi. This is a rose show. This uh, is a rose show. That's okay, so I, I'm going to do a kayfabe reason. Kobashi tested positive for elevated liver enzymes. Like that famous uh, WWE Great American Bash 2006 where they made a bunch of impromptu matches because about eight wrestlers that were on the card had like elevated liver enzymes from a great Kali for his Punjabi prison match. Because of it, they just made it Big Show versus Undertaker instead. Then Bobby Lashley couldn't do it because of elevated liver enzymes. And if I recall, I think they got had a match for Super Crazy on the card, maybe. But he had what it did, too. What does elevated liver enzymes even do to you that it would keep you from wrestling? I don't fucking know. I think it could just be an excuse to say we're not going to have him wrestle today. Hey, wait a second. Kobash is right behind Masawa. Oh, Rasta, welcome. Oh, that, I forgot to ping you. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. Look, Kobash is right there. Well, I mean, just because he has elevated liver enzymes doesn't mean he can't, you know, watch. So give me a second. There, there is a reason why I did that. And the reason is because, one, it's a go-to show. I, I don't want to, like, make this, like, so grand. Because it's a rotation. show. Like, you're getting ready for, for us, so... Man. You, know, might... you, you know you could have just made a following ad and added it in um, Kenze. This is... The, what I... This is the three, musket, the three musketeers against the four pillars, so... Yeah, yeah. but when you consider it, um, Ken um, Suzaki well, is technically a part of the three musketeers. Well, hey, I just found. Um, I just picked whatever. All right, so I got a uh, first result I could find for elevated liver liver enzymes. It's just a great website I went to because I can't believe this is the first choice. Clevelandclinic.org. So I'm gonna learn about elevated liver enzymes from the only doctor that still has a soul in Cleveland. Well, let me rephrase that, a soul that isn't shattered. If you have high levels of the enzymes, it may be temporary or whatnot, but it could also be a sign of a medical condition like say a liver disease or even hepatitis. But an Abby oh. special. Some other things, uh, if you have too much herbal supplements in you, yeah. it could cause that. If you have cirrhosis, it could cause it. Cancer, <laughs> thyroid disease, Wilson disease, alcohol abuse, I just, diabetes. I... You know what I just realized? What? What's that? Out of out of other things, Tawei does not have a matchup. In what? His match, you see... Kawada has Hashimoto, uh, Maso has Mudo, Kobashi has Chono, but Tawei, uh, he never did anything. Yeah, he was kind of the Janetti of the Four Pillars, it feels like. Kind of like if you think about it, based on world titles, Chono was the Janetti of the Three Musketeers. But at least he carried a promotion on his back during his Dark Date. Oh, yeah, definitely. Dark Date? What's a Dark Date? Dark Days, he said. I know, I'm fucking with him. Okay. 
But I see Jug too. I think Jug is that one and only doctor from the Cleveland Clinic that whose soul isn't shattered. By to that by the by the time by the time 2002 hit, Tally was gassed up. Uh, more like 2003, from my experience. But then again, that you I should say 2003. That Yuji Nagata ma Yugi, Yuji Nagata match he had was really good. But 2004, that could be when he was breaking down. Holy oh. critical! Wait, did he? Masawa knocked yep. him out. Yep, rolling elbow. Let's see oh. that instant replay, shall we? Okay, now Rasta. Oh, he killed him. One now, more time. <laughs> now, now uh, Rasta, if you were Slow hit motion. by a roaring elbow by Masawa... Would you try to continue the match, or would you just fall down and say, this is too painful? What would you do if you were in Shono shoes? I would try to take it. I would try. Well, at least you're honest. Some people would probably say, I'm not going to do a match with Masao, he's going to kill me. And then, and then we call him a loser or something. And now it's time for the semi-main event, Inoki Kenta, a rematch from the G1 Climax, where Kenta shocked the world and knocked out Inoki. Let's go, Kenta! And Inoki it's, wants to it's at this point where you realize that, um... That we do as, what? as good as Nova was, when you look at the roster of, like, King of Coliseum 2, you can see that, that um, that, you know, King Coliseum 2, but Noah had no future aces. Like, the closest they had would have been someone like, say, Rikio, if he was in the game. You could do that. Or Is he Shima. in the game? Yeah. Oh. But, I mean, like, say... Uh, like, I mean, when you, and when you look at the roster for, like, all Japan, they had Taiokeya, Kojima as future aces. Uh, no, I mean, Kojima as a future ace. For like, they, they had, had better, as a future younger ace. guys in the upper mid-card compared to Noah. Yep, and New Japan. Tanahashi, Nakamo, even though Nakamo was kind of poopy at this time. But he improved a lot. Oh yeah, he did improve a lot over the years. But still, young guy that's pushed to the top. Of course, some people say you gotta pay your dues. Even even freaking World Japan had a, had an ace in Kenzo Suzuki. Oh yeah, they're building him up to be the future one. But unfortunately, yeah. bad luck is just World Japan's top product in that promotion. And Kenzo and Kenzo Suzuki is just kind of just well. He's more like an indie ace. Oh, now he is, definitely. But then again, I think he's retired. Me too. Ooh. Well, he could make it as an ace in like an indie promotion. If he was like go to like to the big promotions, he'd be a fish in a small he'd be a big fish in a small pond. Oh yeah. It's kinda like what happened to say Yoshitatsu when he was in New Japan, no one cared. When he came back to New Japan, no one cared. When he left for All Japan, he actually had a good position. Like, he's a pretty prominent mid-carder in All Japan currently. Yeah. Yeah, oh, that's right. In September, they're going to do the Budokan show. Their first one in a long Budokan. time. Budokan. Because, like, usually Budokin. their big show was at the Sumo Hall. Their last official Budokan, without any assistance, was 2004, Budokin. where the main event was Kawada versus Hashimoto. Kawada! Budokin. Yeah, now with, uh... Oh, what? What was that? They just ran into each other. Yeah, look at that Itzy replay. Oh, that's a good octopus stretch. But uh, octopus stretch. Well, why are you pinning this quickly? You gotta work. You can't just think. You cannot. Tr even though Inoki is a villain, you don't treat him like he's a scrub. Like, what do you think this is? You're gonna that's face. That's Kenta's gimmick. No matter, <laughs> no matter. Even if there was a main event, Kenta's gonna treat him like a scrub. You saw what he did to Akiyama in that one match he had. Man, Kenta, he has the pride always goes before the fall. And Kenta has way too much pride right now. I know, right? Yep. You need to chill out with that. 
because because Enoki is here for revenge. He wants to he wants that revenge. That's the thing. Also, so, don't remember. Look at look at the guardians that everybody had compared to compared to Noah. Well, Noah was making bangers. Look at the stuff. Look at what they wanted. They had Tom Howard, with the Predator, oh, All yeah. Japan, Jamal, the Gladiator, and Japan, and like they can rely Scott on them. Norton. And oh, right, guys, later on right, for guard. Welcome, JM. We this is the having... semi-main event. We've had some really oh. good matches you missed. The Takatana match with the Funk Brothers is a classic. Okay. And then we we're learning about elevated liver enzymes, and now we're seeing if Kenta can try to repeat history. But right. Inoki... Oof. Inoki is basically... He is more merciless he's than having... he was before. Mm. Remember, right. Kenta knocked him out so, during uh, the tournament. Nah. So after your main event, um, how about a, another edition of GM's New Japan on Fire Pro Returns? Okay. Hmm. All right. Oh, 2.9. So how's everybody's day been? Uh, I've been, been, been kind of <laughs> semi-conscious for most of the day. Like, what's the best way of saying it? Like, like I, I've just been tired. <laughs> I can't even speak. <laughs> you okay? No, no, no. I'm okay. It's just like, but then again, we've had a lot of rain in my area. That's probably why, like, some people, depending on the weather, could be different. Mm. Yo, uh, Lord, we're a made black tiger. Huh? Oh, Octopus stretch. He's hey, no, that's it. Lord, we're a made black tiger seven. Oh, uh, uh. still, the, Kenta may have lost, but he did a pretty good job with what he could do against a uh, pissed off Anoki. And now, he lasted 13 minutes. Yeah, that's also, definitely uh, better than most people. And now it's time for the main event. What's that, Rasta? On the base game, what were the two guys in for wrestling Noah? It was two Coach Scorpio and Richard Slinka. That was it. Yeah, I know. Like, the rest were just free, like, CAW templates like Modest and Morgan. Oh, oh you guys are doing what? Time. Matchmaker? Nah, Wait. this is just me doing exhibition. Now it's time for the main event. It's going to be main event Kasai versus Onita. In a barbed wire death match. And With the, the time limit. And the time. Can the time for explosions is 15 minutes. Now Rasta. Since you have some leeway in World Japan. Will Kensuke Sasaki's life insurance be on the line in this match? No. <laughs> okay. Well we learned something new today. This one's going to be uh, close. I'm trying what Magma is trying to do, we're trying to establish a junior division. Uh, we got one so Andy, through the, a partnership with Zero One. One zero. Uh, yeah, but you pub. Yeah, but here's the thing: you probably won't let us win any belts. Well, maybe if Tomohiro Ishii didn't push because, because World Japan are a bunch of scrubs. Hey, hey, they got Ricky Chosha, Remember. Yeah, and we got Dan Bobbish. What do you got? He's Noah. Dan what Bobbish do you got, Zach? Noah. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zach's Noah. So Yeah, but what does but what does well, what guidance do Zach has on Noah? That is a good question though. We're, we're Noah. We don't really care about Gaijin. So you have nobody, so I automatically win this argument. <laughs> <laughs> What a, whatever, you're just... Ooh, someone ran into the barbed wire ropes there. That's you're dangerous. Just, Zach, you're just jealous that I have better guardians than you. Ooh, it's... I mean, for God's sakes, I have a guardian ace. Noah, doesn't even, Noah barely even has a guardian ace. They've never really had That's... a guardian ace. The closest they had was a brief moment in time, Eddie Edwards. And look what that went them. 88 was one of the title, got one defense in, and that was just it. Then again, one defense and then losing it is a very average reign for a lot of these world titles that aren't New Japan at the time. Like, the Triple Crown had so many one defense reigns throughout its history in all Japan. Like, Dr. Dusty Williams, unfortunately. 
Taiokea. But at least it was better than the Rio de Hama. You know why? 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 They instantly learned from their mistake and had him lose on his first defense of Minoru Suzuki. What you got there, Rasta? What you doing? I'm eating pastrami. I can tell. That's really loud. Pastrami. Please mute the mic if you're going to eat. Please mute the meat before you're going to meet. Well, so yeah, Zach, we have, we have Dan Bobbish and you don't. Haha. <laughs> I don't even think Zach's paying attention. I think he's trying to find your pastrami, Rasta. He's trying to he's trying to make you choke on that freaking meat. <laughs> now, JM, <laughs> if you had to choose between Jun Kasai and Atsushi Onida in a barbed wire match, who would win? Uh, that's uh, that's a tough that's a tough answer. That's a tough question. I guess Onida. All right. Then uh, again, JM, remember, this is Fire Pro. <laughs> I'm just going to say that, remember, it's Fire Pro, bro. We had, during this Road 2 show, we we thought the IWO was going to win that match, but fucking Fujiwara got knocked out, bro. Well, Fujita got knocked out by Toba. Oh, was, yeah. Uh, by an Inzagiri. Yeah. By an Inzagiri, bro. You are getting kicked in the back of your head. Yeah, but, but still, still, it's like such a basic wrestling move. Like, bruh. It's the IWO. I've... Yeah, it's like, this ain't Owen Hart or Inoki's Insiguri. Yeah. Wait this a second, I... I know that I know that move. That move must be, that move that Junkasai did, that must be the K-Driller. Yeah, it reminds me a lot of the Emerald Flosion. I think it's kind of like the Emerald Flosion. You just go, you just go down on your head. Oh, the, <laughs> the sweet Kasai music, music right there. Sweet Kasai music. Oh yeah, because he did a super kick like Shawn Michaels. Oh my mom! That is funny. So when is what time? What's the time limit for when the ring blows up? Oh, uh, f fifteen minutes. Okay. Yeah. Ooh, what a DDT. I and I'm. I, I mostly said it like that because how the, how these matches are. So I was like, they ain't gonna survive. The match is gonna end around probably like, I don't know, fucking 10 minutes. Look, uh, I was fucking wrong. Alright, but uh. Are, are we gonna get a boom? That's the biggest prediction. Are we gonna, are we gonna get a boom? When is the next watch along of WWE India? Ask Jug. You know that's a good question. Motherfucker, what? we should do that Monday. Like you right after we India? do the Wrestle Kingdom English patch show off video, we should definitely watch more of the uh, WWE India guys. Like, uh, what was it, Ramesh Kumar Orden? Oh, them! It's about to explode. It's um, Zach. Yeah. You could escape, right? <laughs> no. How yeah. fast can you roll, roll out of here before we all get blown up, bro? Uh, you cannot roll. No, I'm talking about Zach because we are next to the ring and we need to seconds. go. All right, I got my protective gear on. Zach, get out the way. No, 10, 9, 8, 7, I'm see you guys. Ah, fuck me. Boom. All right, who's dead? Oh, oh he is dead. <laughs> All right, I'm back. As is the referee, apparently. Oh, Nita's dead. Yeah, um. Yeah, um. Someone get a stick and prod him to see if he's moving after that. Nah, nah, I refuse to. He probably he someone probably gotta won. call the call the Red Cross and just pick him up. It's just like Look one at, nurse that's just dragging him by just grabbing a leg. Like I don't get paid enough for this. Let the well, ants carry him out. Well, we learned something new today. Apparently, Jun Kasai is cooler than Atsushi Onita when it comes to not blowing up. Well. <laughs> And that appears. was a match. I like how most of my recommendations is like some wild shit, bro. <laughs> All right.
right. So, where are we doing this? Are we doing this in returns? Are we doing this on KOC two? 